Hey, what's going on guys? Mr. The Reverts here, and today I got some early information about the Call of Duty World War II beta, but before we get into that guys, I do want to remind everybody that the reveal for the game is going to take place tomorrow at 10 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time, and if you guys want to watch the full reveal with me, tell me your PSN ID down in the comments, and I'll make sure to add you, maybe we can get into a party and watch the full reveal together. But uh, anyways guys, onto the beta information. Now, how we found out about this information was through two leaked posters for World War II, and if you guys want to go check them out, they're going to be linked in the description, and I can't really show them on screen right now because of copyright reasons so again they're going to be found in the description but we do have some really good information about the beta so uh, first off here guys the way you access the beta is by pre-ordering the game at a local retail store so either like a GameStop or a Walmart for example but you guys might have already known about that you know that is some pretty standard information for every Call of Duty beta game you know you got to pre-order in order to get access to the beta and then uh, next up here guys the rumor date for the beta is actually set to be August the 18th but that is still not confirmed yet but just take that with a grain of salt but you know I do feel that it's going to be sometime in August, definitely no later than that, maybe September, early September, but uh, I want to say that later uh, later in August is when the beta is going to take place, and that is the rumor as of right now. Again, it is not confirmed yet, so uh, I'll be sure to keep you guys updated on that. And then uh, next up here on the poster, it says that the beta is going to last for three days, but if you guys remember back in Black Ops 3 and Infinite Warfare, the beta actually got extended a couple days, so I do see the same thing happening with World War II. And I do feel that it's going to be lasting maybe five days at most because, you know, they do have some connection issues with the beta. And I guess the way to compensate for the players that are not able to connect online during the beta is by extending it. So that looks like it's going to be happening too. And then next up here, guys, if y'all didn't know, PlayStation players are going to be able to get access to the beta first because of the contract deal they signed a few years back. But apparently that contract is about to expire. So maybe Xbox could be getting early, you know, content instead of PlayStation now. I don't know. But as of right now, PlayStation gets access to the beta and definitely DLC and then uh, next week though Xbox players should be able to get access to the beta so uh, yeah again PlayStation players will be able to play the beta first now you should be able to pre-order the game starting tomorrow so uh, just keep that in mind guys pre-orders are probably going to go live tomorrow so definitely go to your local GameStop or Walmart or any retail store and uh, pick up the game so you'll be able to uh, play the beta but we really don't know yet how to actually enter the beta code if there will be a code actually we don't really know what's going to be happening with that so I'm pretty sure we're going to get some more information about the beta starting tomorrow but as of right now this is like some early information that uh you know you guys might have been interested in like the date and uh, what's going to be happening and stuff like that so i uh, think that's about this guys down in the comments also drop a like if you guys did enjoy and uh, thank you all so much for watching i'm a very time of the day till next time i'll catch you guys later